Hello my lovely little moonbeams. This is Christina and welcome back to my channel, Moonchild Mama Taro. I have another lovely deck here. Um, bag's a little bit of a hint, I mean if you didn't read the name of the video. So this is the Compendium of Constellations. Um, it is an oracle deck. It was created by Claire Goodchild from Black and the Moon. Um, it is a very, very lovely deck and I am very much in love with it. I have to, um, comes in a nice little tuck box. It actually goes down a little bit further so you can easily grab the cards out of it. Um, but I have to download the guidebook to this at some point. These are the backs. It's kind of like a little blue jean backing. Cardstock is really nice. This is your average playing card um, size deck. And does give you the names of the constellations. There was Ursa Major, Ursa Minor, Draco. I'm not going to pronounce them all because I will get it wrong. But, oh, the artwork is so beautiful. It, I love that it's really like almost an antiqued look um, to the borders around each of these constellations. The lovely Cassiopeia. And they do have their uh, keywords down here too, which is really nice. And obviously the watercolor backing with little stars and everything. This is actually a really, really big deck for an Oracle deck. Most of them, I would say the average is anywhere from 45 to 50 cards. This one has 90. So that is a very, very big Oracle deck, but it does feature pretty much all of the constellations. Um, I definitely want to get her other two decks. Um, she has the Arcana of Astrology and the Antique Anatomy Tarot. Um, so those are definitely on my list also because I want to complete my little collection here. And the Antique Anatomy Tarot, you can actually now, um, it was an indie deck, but now it's in pre-order on both the Llewellyn site and I think Llewellyn. Actually, no, I don't think I saw it on there. It is definitely as a pre-order on Amazon right now for, I think, $30. But I believe it's pre-order only if you are a Prime member. Um, I'll have to go and look. But if you do find her on Instagram um, at Black and the Moon, she does sometimes put uh, damage boxed damage boxes. Um, that set will be cheaper, so she does sell the damage boxes of uh, not just the boxes, but the the cards in general. If the box is damaged, she does mark it down and put it on her website. So you can check back there pretty often. Um, so I believe she has got another printing going on of the Arcana of Astrology. I 
and I am definitely getting more into um, astrology also so I am loving this uh, it gives me quite a bit of uh, ideas on what to look for what the names are of each constellation so And this is one of the kinds of boxes that I love too. I mean, it is one of those um, flimsy cardboard little boxes, but it's it's kind of got a different way that you can get these cards out way easier. question do you guys like if I talk through the entire thing do you like if I just show you the cards and have some quips here or there um, leave some comments below let me know what you like right now I'm filming a big batch of like 11 decks um, once I finished filming these I believe I'm going to actually move on to uh, decks I got off of Wish. Um, so those are actually pretty interesting, but I believe that'll be the next group that I um, that I film. Maybe. We'll see. You know, my favorite color is pink, but I have really been digging, like, the blues, greens, and teals, and things like that. Different mixes lately. I don't know why. I've just felt very drawn to it. And would anybody be interested in um, me doing some Pinterest spreads that I find on Pinterest? And I can give you, you know, the settings of the spreads and everything like that. If you're interested in that, please let me know. That would be a fun little series to do also. As always, thank you so much for tuning in. This was the compendium of Constellations Oracle deck. Don't forget to like and subscribe and become one of my lovely little moonbeams. Have a great evening.